I'm Jessica and I'm an artist and today I'm going to teach you how to draw a bunch of different kinds of butterflies. So we're going to start with a big butterfly. We're going to do a diagonal sort of almost almond shape and we're going to do that on each side. So the bottom part is going to be a little bit smaller than the top and more rounded. We're going to do that on each side. Big rounded kind of angle shape and then bring this one around to a little more of a circle. And the butterfly part is going to go in the middle. So the butterfly has a little head and a skinny body that comes down. And this butterfly is going to have long, curly antenna so it can see where it's going. I'm going to put some lines on the body. And this butterfly has a shape that almost mimics the type of body it has. It's got this coloring that goes inside of the body and connects around. And we're going to draw some stripes downward. Here's one kind of butterfly. We're going to draw a little bit more of a smaller curvy butterfly. This butterfly here has very rounded top, very rounded bottom. Same thing on each side. Most butterflies are very equal on each side. So we've got these rounded parts again. The body goes in the middle. This body's going to have not such a specific head. It's just going to be like a long butterfly body. And this butterfly is going to have spots on it. Little spots all over its body. All over its wings, I'm sorry. And on its body, it's going to have, we're just going to color its body all in one color. This butterfly also has antenna. We're going to make this antenna really big and long that go all the way out. Finally, we're going to show you one more kind of butterfly today. This butterfly is, has like these, it comes out like so. The butterfly stretches outward instead of upward. And it has almost a square shape to its wings that come in and down square shape, a little bit of a curve at the bottom. And then from this, it's got this rounded wing that comes out and back up. And this butterfly has a little bit of an angular body. It's kind of pointed at the bottom. We're going to do eyes on this butterfly. And just little antenna that go up. This butterfly's colorings are basically just shade it at the edges and this butterfly also has some shading close to its body and there you go several different kinds of butterflies